Hey guys, how's everybody doing? Today we're back again with the third episode on Infection Free Zone. Today we'll be continuing our campaign, hopefully establishing a more stronger area for our survivors. Let's get this thing started. So we left out uh, at this, uh, left out yesterday at this time, and we're getting attacked by a couple of hordes. Actually, not a couple. There's way too much hordes attacking. Hopefully, we can fend them off. Thank God we have a decent amount of ammunition that can support our uh, our efforts. We're building a tools factory. Yeah, what we need, what I wanted to do is research the chemistry. Uh, research that I need ammunition. So uh, let me continue. Get this. A chemical plant. Oh yeah. Oh no, wait a second, need to pause, I need these guys to go into the car, oh boy this base is going to get destroyed if I don't rush it. Oh boy, no ammo, oh no! <laughs> Ran out of ammo pretty quick. Holy moly. Okay. Yes, yeah, so, so, yeah, we need uh, the ammunition on these squads really gets used pretty quick. I, I mean, it's I don't mind it, but at the same time, it's uh, feel that the squads need more ammunition. Like uh, they just get they just get used. A bit too fast for my liking, to be honest. Let me see. First thing we're going to do is we're going to build the workshop. Need all of these things to get repaired. Yeah. No workers? What? What do you mean no workers? What am I missing? Am I missing workers? Oh, I am missing workers. Okay, let me see if I can invite more people. Do we have any squads that we can invite into our zone? Nothing? Uh, rip. What about these guys here? Okay, nice, nice. All of these have been repaired. Nice. But wh wh why is there no workers? What's going on? Oh boy, I'm missing a lot, am I? Yeah, we need civilians as much as we can. Keep trying to, inviting, to invite people. This is, will not go well if I don't have more people to help to help me in this uh, area. What? Why do I have this much workers assigned to the cookhouse? What the hell? Damn, dude.
yeah our main goal today on for today's video will be establishing some production going for ammunition and also for arms we're going to start researching for the pistols because currently the only thing we can produce is ammunition and or a fuel we can also produce tools which i'm already working on it farming is at max because i can't research at the moment anything else and anything else here yeah that's about it so we'll try to establish these things let me see can i arms factory we'll build this arm factory right around here what resources does it need 11 tools i have six raw metal six 35 i have and i'm missing wood okay yeah i'll get the wood from here probably but i'll need more wood so we'll assign some gather wood operation for this area See, are we gonna get attacked tonight? I sure do hope not. Hmm. Okay, let's decrease. Get these guys to the warehouse. Two hours later. Hey guys, how's everybody doing? <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. We skipped a couple of days, and by couple, I mean about around 30 days. Yeah, because we had a lot of management issues to deal with, and it took me quite a lot of time to fix. So instead of me just boring you with the boring details and everything, I just, you know, did a skadoosh and skipped all the parts that I'm. Uh, that I felt that are boring for the video. So yeah, as you can see, I managed to build a couple extra shelters. I managed to expand my defenses. I built another cookhouse, a couple of factories, more farms. And I my population is currently booming with 143 survivors. So yeah, this is it. And let's keep watching the video and thank you for your patience.
still have 11 more. Holy moly, dude, what the hell? Okay, I'm guessing uh, let's build the fortified gate in this zone. So, guys, we're back again. We skipped a couple of days uh, from the last uh, last where we stopped because we was having some issues with the, the resources. Now I managed to fix these issues with the resources and we're building our second fortified island. So the second fortified island is going to serve as the main shelter for my uh, community. And it's going to have a resource house, a storage house, it's going to have a, a huge uh, cooking house. Okay, and we're going to dismantle this big building right here and we're going to build as much farms as we can. We're going to have some uh, more friendlies gather guarding this spot. We have a decent amount of uh, of resource of uh, fortification going on and a decent uh, population, so we need to work on that and we need to increase it as much as we can. After this is done, we're going to deconstruct this building. Max, yep. Need all the resources we can get. We're gonna fortify the living hell out of this area. <laughs> yeah, and also we need uh, as much more production going on into these uh, buildings. Okay, shelter is done. Yeah, sorry about that. The citizens are kind of starving, which is not good. We need to work on that as well. So, do I have citizen diet, live in poor conditions? Okay. So, let's get the first thing going. How much uh, grain do we have? We have a lot of grain. We need to build another cookhouse for a start in this area. Cookhouse right here. Yep, accept. Let's go, people. You are all welcome. Again, I'm I'm sort of, I'm really struggling with wood. This is the most important resource I am missing because everything requires wood. Literally everything you want to build is wood, 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 everything. <laughs> That's a big of an issue I need to work on at the moment. But but things are looking a bit more good for us. You know, they're a bit more brighter for my uh, for the future of the colony of the colony. Uh, I mean of the uh, colony. Yeah, yeah. Let's call it a colony. <laughs> Colonizing the zombie land. <laughs> The zombies are the natives and we're the colonizers we're, and we're gonna kick all their asses. Yeah. This is another island that's really good, but I don't want to expand into it because if I keep destroying resources here, it's gonna be a menace <laughs> to keep up. Can this thing get built, built already? What am I missing? Okay. One more wood. Literally one more wood and it should be done. No resource wood. Ah, oh, come on, man. This takes priority. Dude. One more wood. Just take one more piece. Holy moly. As I said, everything in this uh, game requires wood, and it's a bit of a hassle. <laughs> I'm, I'm literally... I have every resource in the game but wood. <laughs> what is this? Wait, what? Okay, I got it. Now let's place it here. God damn, man.
Oh yeah, right, the population uh, is dying because uh, not enough resources. Yikes. Oh, not enough food, sorry. Can they just build one of either one of these already? Come on, dude. What am I using you for? Ah, oh, they won't wait for these two, god damn it. I have 18 wood. The, come on. Literally 18 wood. This should be more than enough for everything. Why aren't anything getting finished here? Ah, oh, dude, this guy. Really? Again with these uh, annoying people? Stop killing my population, man. Holy. That's so mean. <laughs> this happened so many times. I'm. Uh, it's like the re. Look at this. Okay, finish it. Gonna let them go back. Let these guys go back to. I don't know. Nice. Okay, tomorrow. This is gonna get workers and this is gonna get workers. Let's see. I have 25 wood. This should be. All of it should be over like. They should build it already. I have no idea what's the issue to be honest. Pull these guys back. These guys back here. Place them into this. Put them here for now. Finally, storage and a cookhouse are done. Let's go. Yeah, this should uh, work for my favor. Now, is this thing gonna, going to get finished? How much wood do I have? I have 31 wood. Okay. Awesome. Should build another cookhouse, to be honest. 26 wood and 10 metal. Yeah, this should be easy. Yeah, the population is dying, but we're, we're gonna get this done. Don't worry about it. We're getting this done. Nothing to worry about right here. I wish I could build another wall on this zone, but it's uh, probably not gonna happen. So what we're going to do is... Let's see, fortified gate around this area. Yep. We're going to connect it with fortified walls with this zone. Yep. Dude, really? Like, come on? Hello? Why, why is this guy so... Why are they so mean? What the fuck? <laughs> they just like went... Oh, no. He's gathering resources. Let's kill him. What the hell is that about? Again, look. Again with the same bullshit. How are they even reaching this zone? Like, aren't they dead? They're confusing me, to be honest. This needs to be a priority. ASAP. Nice. I'm missing fuel? 
Will I? Oh shit, yeah, I am missing fuel. Uh, which thing is producing stuff that I don't need? Okay, I currently don't need ammunition. I have like 31. So we're gonna focus on the food. Anything I can research? No, all finished. Okay. Damn, dude, I'm losing. My civilians are dying pretty fast. God damn it. Okay, guys, this is going to be the end of today's episode. Uh, this is this is a really fun journey so far. I'm going to show you the base uh, last time before we head off. So we currently are building the walls on the southeastern, uh, southwestern side, so we can secure this area. So we can have, you know, how I say this, like it's a landing to this other island, so we can, you know, scavenge resources easily. I'm going to get one of these buildings as a warehouse so when I scavenge and I'm gonna have a multiple towers here so they can you know protect my civilians instead of them just getting shut down by these hostiles that are approaching same thing here I'm going to build a warehouse in this zone or this zone and I'm going to let the civilians scavenge everything in this area and maybe just maybe uh, have one of these zones as a uh, as a cookhouse or a shelter for the survivors you know just defend it as, as much as I can and yeah, that's about it. Thank you all for watching, and I hope I see you again tomorrow on another episode of this awesome game. See you later, boys. Blazer out.